Now that your samples are mapped across the keyboard in the NNXT, you can tweak some of the parameters below to alter the sound. If you're not familiar with ADSR or the other parameters shown, and you don't know what the heck an LFO is, check out one of our later videos for a more in-depth description. For now, just tweak some of the settings until you get something that you like. When you're ready to save your patch, click on the floppy disk icon, and later on you can load the patch again by selecting the folder icon. If you're using a redrum and you filled up any of the 10 slots you can load samples onto, you can adjust the sound using the controls below it. Once you're happy with the sounds that you've gotten in the redrum, you can use the floppy disk icon to save and open it later again with the folder icon. Yeah.